Hi everyone, so today's video is kind of like a current favorites video. I haven't filmed one of these in a couple months, so I'm filming another one today. And if you hear talking or something, it's just my roommate watching TV, so that's what that is. But yeah, let's just get into the video. I'm gonna start with like skincare, makeup stuff. The first is this Palmer's coconut oil formula with vitamin E and it's a luminous hydration facial oil and I literally bought this at CVS. It has a dropper and it's so nice feeling. It smells really good. It smells like really coconutty and it was like nine dollars I want to say and I just like wanted to try facial oil but I didn't want to spend a lot so I got this and it's really good. I use it like after I shower. I definitely don't use it under makeup and I don't use it every day but it just makes my face feel like really moisturized and I'm into that. Going along the lines of that, I showed this in a video before, maybe a haul, but this is my Olay Henriksen Truth Serum. It's literally like down to here, almost gone. I got this in December and I'm definitely gonna rebuy it. I just love the way it makes my skin look. So sorry if the angle changed, my memory card just got full, so I had to delete some stuff, but I was talking about the True Serum and I forgot exactly what I was saying, but I wanna repurchase this. It really just makes my skin have like a really healthy glowing look to it instead of looking dull, which like I get sometimes. And I use this with my jade roller which both of these were given to me for christmas by a friend but i literally use this every morning every night and i just kind of like roll outwards up you know however you use it but i use the big side and then the little side like under my eyes over my eyes on my nose i layer that under makeup i didn't use it at night so this just like feels really cooling and like deep puffs or whatever i just like the way that makes my skin feel Something new that I got recently uh, is this Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue Tinted Hydrating Gel Cream and it has SPF 30 and I just got it in the color Opal but I use this as my tinted moisturizer and it's just really like, it looks like a thick formula but it's so light, so just kind of feels so natural. You can barely tell anything's on your skin. I just really like the way it feels. It lasts all day. It has medium coverage, which I like. And then if I have like a pimple or under eye circles, I just put on concealer, but it sits nicely. It doesn't oxidize and it's $30 for this size. And I was going to get the Laura Mercier, which is 48. So definitely a good price for that. Another thing that I recently have been loving, got this for Christmas too, is the Hoola bronzer. Everybody knows about this, but I had never used it. So I was giving it as a gift. Very excited that I got that and I just use it all over my face just to warm up my face after I do my face makeup and I contour with like a different thing. But I've been loving this just to like give myself a little bit of color because I'm pale and it's winter. So I don't know if I'll use this in the summer, but I definitely just like the way it layers on. It's matte and it just looks warm and natural. It gives me color. Another thing I got kind of recently is the Dry Bar Dry Shampoo. And I got it in the Lush scent because at first I got the original scent and it smells like diaper powder like for babies which is gross so I got this one which smells a lot better and it actually works really well I used to use living proof and I got this one instead to try it out just because I don't really like the smell of the living proof one and I like the smell of this it definitely works um you know what else do you want in a dry shampoo I got a heat protectant recently um, from Bumble and Bumble. It's the Hairdressers Invisible Oil Heat UV Protective Primer. And it smells so fresh and nice in your hair. And I just use this before I blow dry my hair, which is the next thing I'm gonna talk about. But my hairdresser recommended this to me and it's just really nice for protecting and it like makes your hair just have a nice smoothness and look to it. And this is the mini size, it was $10. I just wanted to try it out, but I think I definitely will be buying the big one when I run out. Going along with uh, hair and heat tools, I got this for Christmas, and all of these things are like things I got for Christmas. I don't know. But I got this, and I use it every time, not every time, but like 
majority of the time I wash my hair because my hair is so short now that it dries weird. If I don't blow dry it, it gets like weirdly curly and like pieces stick out at weird angles because I have layers and the front pieces look weird. I don't know. So I just like using this and it literally takes five-ish minutes to use. Um, I like let my hair air dry probably like as much as I can and then when it's still just a little wet I use this I use it on the hottest setting and just separate it into two sections and you literally just like brush it through blow dries it makes it look basically straight and then I go on the cool setting just to like finish it off and give it like a nice shine and this is like a game changer like I never have to wait for my hair I never owned a blow dryer but I love this one I love the way it makes my hair look I don't have to straighten it anymore which is amazing and highly recommend got this on Amazon it's not expensive it's Revlon and these are like everywhere but I love the flat one just because I wanted it for like straightening not the round one to be used to give like that look um I just have a few random things now I guess uh the first is beanies these three are all the exact same beanie cream gray and mustard yellow they are from PacSun and I got the gray one on Black Friday and then the white and the yellow were, or the cream and the yellow were on sale for like five dollars so I bought both and it's freezing in Boston and I walk to the train for work and I walk everywhere I go so I wear beanies every time I go outside and I just like having like the three different options for variety since I am wearing them every day, but I just love like this style. Like, I don't wanna wear the yellow one because my outfit, but this style just kind of like sits, you know, and then it has a little part that kind of sticks up at the back. And I just really like how they look without the like pom-pom on top. So I've been rocking these all winter. Another thing along the lines of like clothes and stuff are cargo pants and i have a lot of cargo pants i have like a few pairs to show you right here um these ones are from lf i need to like film a haul but these are karmar from lf and they're actually like a denim material and then they have the pockets and the like scrunched bottom actually these weren't in my haul i already included these um but i literally wear these almost every time i go out and just like i'm really into them because they're just so comfortable like it doesn't feel like you're wearing jeans because obviously they're like loose and have a stretchy waistband and then I wear like a cute top or bodysuit and it just looks really nice and flattering the other pair is also black but these are leather ones fake leather because they're from Nasty Gal but the inside's really soft and they just have the stretchy they're the fake leather car uh the pockets again and the like same bottom. I love these with sneakers, with bodysuits again. Um, any like little crop top, I've worn them with just a sweater and stuff to go out to dinner. I've worn them with booties, boots. So I definitely can like make these look a lot of different ways. And I think these are a really unique pair because they do have the leather look. I also have like a green pair. Um, I have a windbreaker pair. I just ordered a gray pair. But yeah, I just really. I'm into them because I just like to be comfortable. I don't like tight clothes. I don't like tight anything. I just want to be comfy and like feel like I'm in sweatpants, but look cute while doing it. So that's the solution. I have a pair of shoes that are a favorite and that is my Doc Martens. I'm just really happy I finally got Doc Martens. I've literally, these are the 1460 black Napa. So they're they're really like soft like you can flex the leather which like the original ones they're like stick hard like rigid so I really like how these are soft I have been wanting Doc Martens forever and I finally got them um, I got them on their website with like a discount code from putting in my email and they are expensive but like I just literally I'm so glad I finally have them I love how they look I've worn them so much since I got them and um, everyone said they like kill you when you break them in and the first time I wore them, yes, my ankles in the back were like torn up. I think I was bleeding, but um, I wore band-aids the next time and I just like after two times wearing them, they're completely fine and now I can just wear them everywhere and I'm not in pain. So that's great. Um, yeah. 
I have another random thing, but I got this new water bottle. It looks similar to a Hydro Flask, but it's Camelback. I've always been a Camelback fan um, ever since the days of like their colored clear plastic ones way back when. And then Hydro Flask came about, but this is like basically the same vacuum and um, keeps it cold, has the same like straw lid. But yeah. I just bought this one because it's 32 ounces. It's literally bigger than my head. But I had a, I can compare. I had a 20 ounce one, which you can see like the difference. Definitely a lot bigger. Um, I just wanted one I wouldn't have to fill up as often. So I got this. The last two things are food. The first one is kiwis. Really, really random, but I'm in a kiwi moment right now. I literally eat one every single day and I just cut them in half and eat them with a spoon and I just love a good kiwi. It's just really good. The second one is a protein bar, granola bar thing. It's Dang brand, their chocolate sea salt flavor and they have 10 grams of protein and only two grams of sugar and they're so good. They're just like crunchy with like a lot of different seeds and chia seeds, sunflower seeds, pea protein, chicory root, blah, 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 like lots of different very good for you things and they're keto I'm not keto but I just love the flavor and I like really into these I bring them to work and have them but yeah that is the end of the video that is everything that I've been loving recently that I could think of um hope you guys enjoyed this video if you're new here subscribe stick around follow me on instagram and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys